Okay, next lecture. Okay, at the end of the lesson, students should be able to use the normal distribution to solve related problem. Example 6. The lifespan of a calculator has the normal distribution with a mean of 60 months and standard duration of 5 months. If a calculator that starts malfunctioning of within 3 one, three and a half years of purchase will be replaced. By a new one, find the percentage of calculator that are expected to be replaced. Okay, we can write the distribution. Your x with the normal distribution, mean 60 and variance 35. Where your x is the lifespan of calculator in a certain month. Okay, now we to find the probability x between 0 and 3.5 times 12 equal 42. Okay, you cannot read from the table without standardized. How to standardize? Your, your, your x 0 minus your mean, mean 60, divided by standard deviation. Your standard deviation 5. Then another one, your 42 minus mean. 60 divided by standard deviation. After simplify, you can get Z between negative 12 and negative 3.6. Okay. Okay, you have your Z now at the negative part. Then you can change to be a positive part. Where is, where is your Z between 3.6 and 12? Then you can read over the table. Z greater than 3.6 minus Z greater than 12. Your, the three, your Z greater than 3.6, you can read from the table, you can get 0 0.0016, but for your Z greater than 12, you get 0. The percentage of calculator that are expected to be replaced is 0 0.0016 times 100%. Your percentage of calculator that are expected to be replaced is 0 0.016%. Another example, the height of adult man is normally distributed with a mean of 170 cm and standard deviation of 8 cm. If 99% of adult male exceed a certain height, what is the height? Okay, your question is normal distribution with mean x with the mean the normal distribution mean 172 and your standard deviation 8 square. Your variant x square and your standard version is a. Okay, now you have to find probability x greater than h. Where is your h is exit 0 0.99 percent or 0 0.99. Okay, now you before you read, you can set the h minus 172 divided by a equals 0 0.99. Okay, where you see here your your, your k is negative side because your probability greater than 0 0.5. 0 0.99 more than 0 0.5. That's why your z now at the negative side. z greater than negative k. Okay, how to read this solution? z greater equal negative k. 1 minus the probability z less than negative k equals 0 0.99. You can read from the table z greater than k for these cases then your 0 0.99 1 minus 0 0.99 you can get 0 0.01 after that you can read the front the table 0 0.01 your k now negative 2.33 okay to find your h negative 2.33 is the probability your 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 k equal h minus mean 172 minus over 8 your standard deviation that's why after simplify your h equal 153.36. Okay, seeing the probability is greater than 0.5, k must be negative. 
That's why you can get K to a negative 2.33. This is your region. Your Z get a negative K. That's, that's why your, your K now at the negative side. How to get this value? The total spell shape is 1 minus Z less than negative. Z less than K. Where is your K is negative. Problem, problems involving the, the determination of the value of mean and value of both. If the random variable x has a normal distribution with mean 45 and variance sigma square, and probability x greater than 55 equals 0 0.288, find the value of, sigma, of standard deviation. Okay, because you your your question is normal distribution x with normal distribution mean. 45 variance sigma square. Okay, for x greater than 51, 0 0.288. Okay, 0 0.28 less than 0 0.5. That's why your z, get, uh, you can, you must standardize before you read z greater than 55 minus mean 45 divided by sigma standard deviation. Okay, equals 0 0.288. You can read from the table 0 0.288. Then, you can simplify here in 51 minus 45, you can get 6 sigma. Okay, you can read from the table because your probability less than 0 0.5. 0 0.288. Z greater than 0. Your sig over sigma is 0 0.5. Sig, your sigma equals 10.71. Okay, 6 divided by 10.71. You can get 0 0.56. You can read from the table 0 0.288. Then you can get okay. If x with normally distribution distributed with mean new 12 and x greater than 32 is equal 0 0.8438. Your probability is like greater than 0 0.5. Okay, z greater than 32 minus mean over square root 12 equals 0 0.8438. Your z or your w now 32 minus mean divided by standard by divided by 12. Okay, since when you sketch the condition 0 0.8438, there is uh, your, your w at the negative side, negative w. You can find your new with 32 minus mean divided by standard deviation negative, equal negative 1.01. .01. Your mean is 35.5. Okay, z greater 0 0.1562. From the table, you can see here z greater 1.01 .01 equal 0 0.1562. Okay, example 9. The mark of examination were normally distributed with mean new and value sigma square. 10% of the candidate had more than 75 mark and 20% had less than 40 mark. Find the value of mean and variance. Every the normal distribution, distribution mean new sigma square variant. At greater than 75 equals 0 0.1. At less than 40 equals 0 0.2. Where is your x is the mark of marks in examination? Okay, this is your region for 10%, 0 0.1. You must standardize before you read your 75 minus mean divided by sigma. You can get your new equal. You can write your new equal first equation. Z less than negative 40 minus mean divided by sigma equals 0 0.2. Okay, we your you can read from the table 0 0.2, you can get 0 0.8416. Okay, we, after simplify, you can get mean equal. Fifty three point eight seven. You can substitute fifty three point eight seven into the question and you can get the answer.